Right, so it says firmware download install DJI RC N1 firmware. It doesn't say what one it is. Let's go ahead and press install and see what happens. So hopefully what happened was there was a 1.2.1 or something. I can't remember all the numbers. There's been so many banded around. But everybody downloaded the uh, installation for the new controller, which would link the controller for the uh, Mavic Air 2 to use with the Mavic Mini 2. And obviously everyone was getting problems with the distance, etc. So um, losing connection, the, the drone was then coming to return to home. I did a video on it earlier, um, which everyone found very interesting. So thanks for that. Thanks to all the people that subscribed after I did the video as well. Um, so I hope people found it useful. Uh, okay, firmware installed. Let's press the X. <clears throat> And let's go into Go Fly app, and you'll see aircraft firmware check for updates. Let's tap on that, check in. <clears throat> firmware is up to date. Fly Safe database, check up to date. Right, Fly Safe database apps. App version. I've got 1.20, you can see there. I thought there was a 1.2. Point one. We will see. Okay. All right. So I've downloaded or updated the latest firmware, and so hopefully that's the latest one. All right. Up on the roof terrace. Let's go for a quick flight. All right. Okay. Cross your fingers. All right. Let's go up 15 meters from where I am. And away we go. Two hundred and fifty meters away. Four hundred. Okay, so it's gone like five hundred meters away. Now the other day when I did this test, I got to about three hundred, like everybody else, and it actually lost signal, lost connection, and then returned to home. So I'm going to go to about a thousand. Thousand meters away, one kilometer, one bar less, I think. Okay, thousand meters. All right, I think that'll do. I think uh, looking at this, then the problems that uh, we had before have been resolved. Let's put it in HDR mode. HDR, where are you? HDR. Okay, that should work better. Right, let's come back. So that's good news. It looks like the whatever version it was, um, <laughs> I think the one came out about two days ago. It's the ninth now, so I think it should have been uh, okay. So I think for those people that were in doubt and worrying whether or not the the new firmware update was okay to use, I think this answers the question. I think it is okay. Normal mode. Did that work in tripod? Yeah. All right, tripod is now C mode. I think it's that cinematic mode, as in the Man Mavic Mini. Okay, stop there. Let's change over to photo. All right, let's go quick shot. So we've got all the options. Yep, fine. Take a photo. All right, that works. Okay. Okay, looks all right, folks. I think you can safely download the new software firmware update for the controller. I think that's a positive yes. <laughs>